ブッチャケ English for Teens! Welcome to Boot Chuck English for Teens. I'm Alex Schroer. And I'm Jasmine Thorne. Let's get started by watching today's skit. What's going on? You've really been glued to your phone recently. Me? Just chatting with my boyfriend. 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 Your what? How have you not told me about him? Huh? I could swear I told you about him. I'd remember something like that. Wow, this is huge news. Yeah, and this is definitely the first time we've heard about it. I wonder who it is. I'm sure we'll find out soon enough now the cat's out of the bag. Hillary sure seems surprised though. Yeah, she said, How have you not told me about him? How have you not is a very useful expression for scolding people who haven't done something yet. It sounds like you expected them to have done it already. Oh, maybe this example sounds familiar. How have you not done your homework yet? Or maybe you ask your friend about a viral video, but they haven't seen it. How have you not seen this yet? You can also make a similar expression with never. How have you never. For example, how have you never tried miso katsu? In the case of never, it doesn't sound like you didn't fulfill a responsibility. It sounds less like scolding and more like disbelief. Like if I said, How have you never read Butchake? I don't know. I think everyone has a responsibility to read Butchake. I'm sorry, you're right. I don't know what I was thinking. Our motte on point for today is a classic one the difference between L and R. It's a tricky one, so it's worth reviewing even if you already know it. First, let's look at the L sound. For L, the tip of your tongue comes up to touch behind your front teeth, like this.、Uh, uh. On the other hand, for R, your tongue should be up and back in the mouth, with the sides of your tongue nearly touching your back molars, like this.、Er, er. Now, let's listen to them one after another. First L, then R.、Uh, er. Great. Now, let's finally practice it in words. Repeat after me Lice, Rice, Glue, Grew, Play, Pray. Okay, this time try to guess if it's an L or an R. Grass. That's right, grass. One more. Lock. Yes, lock. L and R sure are tricky to tell apart, huh? I just remember them like this. What? My left hand makes an L. I, I don't see how that helps. I think it's pretty obvious. <laughs> well, that's all for today. Be sure to try these phrases out and don't forget to have fun. See you next week. <laughs>